Hello everybody, this is Mr. Pockets again. Um, it's been a while since I've made a video, but I have a good design for you guys today. It is a tractor. Um, tons of people ask me for tractors and I always have to go, Oh, I don't know how to make a tractor, but I can make a race car, which is totally different from a tractor, so they always say, oh, I guess that would be okay. So, I came up with a tractor design. You're going to need, um, one dark green 260, one yellow 260, and one, maybe two black 260s. Inflate your first green 260, and leave about four inches at the tip. You're going to start out making the seat of the tractor. So make about a two inch loop twist. And then make a pinch twist. Now make about a one, one and a half inch bubble. And another pinch twist. Now make another one and a half inch bubble. And another pinch twist. Now, make, make a two inch bubble, maybe even a three inch bubble, and make another pinch twist. Now make another pinch twist, because this is where the steering wheel will be, and you kind of want it to be pretty sturdy. Alrighty, now make about a five inch bubble. And another pinch twist. And another three inch bubble. And another pinch twist. Lots of pinch twists. Alright, and just connect the rest of your balloon to the, the pinch twist right here. Right there. Make, make this... You're pretty much just making a triangle, uh, a rectangle right here. And you can, if you want, you can make another pinch twist to hold the seat in place. I'll do that since I have a bit of balloon left. And you can break off the rest. Alright, so you have the chassis of your, of your tractor right now. Just a, a rectangle with a seat coming out of it. But we will change that. Inflate your yellow 260. And leave quite a bit at the tip. I'm going to say six inches. Alrighty. Now, this can be done differently by different people. But I like to do it like this. Connect your yellow 260 to your top two pinch twists, right here. Now bring it across the rectangle and connect it with that pinch twist as well. So you kind of have it coming across like that. Now cross it again on the other side and connect it back to where you first connected it. Now, twist it down to your bottom two pinch twist right here. And then, take it through the, the little loop you made and connect it to that pinch twist. So, you should have something that looks kind of like this. And you can just break off, um, break off the rest of your balloon. But keep it inflated, because I actually, I actually messed up right here. Um, what I should have done was, when I, when I connected it to these pinch twists, I should have made a tulip twist first. But I'll just do that right now. 
All right, so make, make a tulip twist. This will be the steering wheel. That's a, that's a bit thick for a steering wheel, so I'm going to redo it. Alrighty. Now, make a tiny little bubble to be the axis of the steering wheel. Just a tiny little bubble. And twist it into... these two pin twists, and you can break off the rest. Alrighty, so now, now you have a tractor and it has a steering wheel. And now we're going to add the wheels. And I fashioned these wheels off of um, my race car wheels. Inflate your black 260 and leave about 5 inches at the tip. Now, make, make a pinch twist, make about a three to four inch loop twist, make a one, one and a half inch bubble, and another pinch twist, now, here's one wheel, you're going to Twist off about one inch down the balloon and twist into the seat right right here. This this pinch twist pinch twist right there. Alrighty, and now you're just gonna do it in reverse. Make about a one and one and a half inch bubble, followed by a pinch twist. Then a one inch bubble and a pinch twist, and then a four inch loop. And then you're going to take that loop and tuck it in just like that. So, break off the rest. I should have kept that inflated in my bag. Sure, the wheels are symmetrical. Alrighty, here is the tractor so far, but I'm gonna add front wheels with the last bit of scrap of this balloon. You you know the way this works. Just make a tulip twist and then twist it in half. And you have your tractor balloon. Mm. 